In the Middle East, it's not always easy to know who the good guys are. <laughs> Netflix's latest thriller blurs the lines even more, showing the human side of the Israeli-Palestinian conflict. She's a menace. Netflix thinks the series may rival the success of Homeland across the globe. We were in the States now, in Washington. In the Fauda's creators say they set out to make a groundbreaking show from the start. This is the first time, I think, that you open the, this window to people abroad to see the conflict in Israel. This is what we were trying to show, that there's a price for this war, and every one of us, each and every one of us, is paying that price. Fauda, which follows a group of Israeli soldiers who disguise themselves as Palestinians, is just the latest attempt by Netflix to appeal to both its English-speaking base as well as its growing number of international subscribers worldwide, a user base that it's increasingly counting on to drive profits. You don't value what we have achieved. Instead of spending a hundred million dollars on mega productions like House of Cards, <laughs> Netflix is shelling out just a few million for the rights to local shows like Danish drama Rita, the Norwegian hit Occupied, and Call My Agent from France. The beauty of the Netflix model, it doesn't really matter where it's created, it's available globally. And that globalization is something that Amazon and Netflix are doing an incredible job of leveraging. Netflix also needs to fend off competition from local streaming firms, giants like Amazon and upstarts like Hulu, which has also found success showing subtitled series like the original version of Homeland, the Israeli series Hatufin. Netflix is probably spending upwards of $8 billion of cash investment in new programming this year on a global basis. Amazon's probably spending, you know, $5 billion on global programming. Both of these companies have the ability to, you know, finance very expensive, great content wherever it comes from. For the creators of Fauda, the global success of the show has been unexpected. For some, some very awkward reason, then again, this miracle this very mysterious thing that happened here in Israel is happening all over the world now. I can show you my Twitter, I can show you my Instagram. So many people related to it. Fauda shows when it comes to compelling content, binge watching knows no borders. Samuel Burke, CNN Money, Tel Aviv.